I may say that today we're going to take another look at cars. Uh, it's a mod I've been working on and off for the past while. Um, I have neglected my YouTube channel recently due to having various school exit exams and stuff. So this is just going to be a quick overview of what we have in so far, roughly, the categories. If you want to know more details, download the mod. So first of all, we Minecraft 194 now. It's, it's pretty nice in here, quiet and all with so few mods so far, but it is more and more stable in 1.9, so there's that. Um, of course we have pipes. Um, the pipes um, have a little texture change, as you can see. This is temporary, as I'm trying to experiment with a good look for the pipes. And of course, as you can see, they work just as fine as always. If you enable them. Um, the renderer is a lot more efficient. I've rewritten both the static and dynamic renderers to optimize their graphics card usage. However, you won't really be able to notice it all that much. However, a change you might notice is that the items now rotate in the direction they're traveling in. So you can see them rotate a little bit so you can see them better. It, it's pretty nifty. Next up, um, there's the wires, but we also have gates. Many interesting gates, like an AND gate. Now, we have the screwdriver. As you know, you, of course, you can rotate the gate with it, but you can also disable things. And in this version, you can disable specific sides. That's a new feature. So you can just click on a side and disable that one specifically, which is a lot more intuitive. But the real killer feature is the ability to place a torches on gates, like this. I've just inverted this input, and it's inverted compared to its regular state. You can also, of course, take off the torches, or even this one, to create a NAND gate, and it actually pops up as a NAND gate in the inventory. Um, if you place some torches, um, the torches will be kept if you break the gate or middle click it, and as you can see, they stay with it. Next up, storage, another interesting module. Oh, right, um, the RS latch is a gate that we've added. I haven't added gates a lot recently. I'll try to look into that a bit more in the future. Um, but storage. First of all, we've added locks, which can be tight, and you can use them from, let's say, chests. Um, they only block player interaction. They don't block extraction, but I cannot open the chest unless I use the key on the lock. But machines can extract from just fine. Now, I know that's not perfect, but the bonus is it works on all Vanla containers, and anything using iLockable container, I will also be looking into adding special APIs for those who don't want to use iLockable container in the future. Of course, there's also a master key, which lets you open any lock if you're an admin. And uh, finally, we have backpacks, but I've decided to put them behind a glass ceiling, or a glass wall, so that nobody will steal them unless they also want some free grass glass shards. So let's take one of those backpacks out. As you can see, they can be colored. Those and the locks are inspired by Copy Girl's Better Storage, a pretty awesome storage mod, which is, is really cool, yes. So you can put things in the backpack, you can shift left click to put it on, and now I have it on myself. And now if I shift right click on an empty spot, I can take it off. Again, shift left click, shift right click. And the item is of course kept. So, yeah, that's that's what's been happening in the car set world. To sum up, we have some um, new pipe texturing and improvements. We have some gate fancy magic. We have some locks and keys. We have some backpacks. Um, there's also other things in the mod like um, audio tapes, which I cannot showcase right now because my headphones are not working and my entire uh, in-game audio recording setup is temporarily frozen or oh, graphite which is a tweak option and that's about it for now i understand that that's not a lot of features not what you've come to expect but um i've been busy and i will try to find a bit more time to add new features in the future so see you soon um and i hope you keep enjoying the little messy world of car set thank you